Hey guys, JCM here, and we have 12 minutes of battery. God damn it. Be back in a bit. There. That's better. 100 minutes of battery. <laughs> and I got the, uh, the old one there charging. <laughs> Alright, let's get to this. Um, this box came in the mail today, and I'm not sure which what it is, because I got a couple things in the mail right now. But if it is what I think it is, then it's going to be an awesome unboxing for me. I'm going to have a total nerd out here. So, unboxing knife. I'm also going to dig right in. This came all the way from Chicago. So, from the uh, collector's gallery. So, probably man, wow. So, it's not a cookery. I'm sorry. I can't afford those right now. I'm... And get another stuff, so probably won't see another cookery for probably a year. <laughs> so, I really need to get my workbench going because I have no place on to unbox anything anymore. I don't have a table space. Right. And here we go, guys. Paper. I love paper. I don't know. I ordered paper. Oh my god. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. Don't be sure. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> and it's still in its uh, plastic wrap. Ain't that nice? <laughs> so yeah. There you go, kitties. Let me get rid of this. Ah, peanuts. Typical. So the story behind this is. I saw a YouTube video of a guy building one on YouTube and it looks so cool that I wanted to get one. But when but all the uh, ones that I see for sale are between $240 to $500. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> so, um, now I love sci-fi models, I love Star Wars stuff and this looked really cool and I had to try and find it and get one but when I found out the price I was like fuck that that is ridiculous for a model kit so uh, what I ended up doing is I found one that was on bid on eBay and it was at fifty dollars so I ultimately ultimately won it for seventy one dollars so I got it just so yeah plus seventeen dollars uh, uh shipping and handling so it came out to about eighty bucks so I got it for under a hundred bucks, which I think is pretty spectacular. Uh, personal victory for myself. And <laughs> we're, as soon as I get a hobby bench made, um, we're gonna build it. We're gonna build it and paint it. And this is a snap tight kit, so we're gonna glue it and I wanna hide the seams with putty and stuff and uh, try and do the best I can with it. So. Now what attracted me to this particular model kit is that um, the legs are you know, all hinged and move posable. So that's key factor in this kit that, uh, that attracted me to it. So, <laughs> yeah. And it's a big scale fucker too. So yeah. I'm so geeking out right now. I want to open it up but I know better. <laughs> I might break something. So, we'll open it up on the day we build it. How about that? So, thanks for watching. And uh, like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos.